So you've made some comments that some people deem controversial, right? You've talked about gender. You've talked about women. You've talked about uh, uh, fat shaming necessarily, mm -hmm. society, yes. religion. There's some things that you've said that people have vehemently disagreed with. And then some people, they're like, hell yeah, yeah. Pearl, nailed it. Someone needed to say it. That's kind of how the way it works is when you take a stance on something, you're going to have allies and then you're going to have people basically uh, forming sort of in the enemy camp. So, but we also know, especially um, with social media and YouTube and long form content, that short clips and little reels and uh -huh. clips mm -hmm. can be taken out of context, right? Mm -hmm. So you've said a lot of things. Out of everything you've said, uh, is what do you think has been the most misconstrued about you? Mm -hmm. uh, and if there's anything you would walk back, what would it be? If there's anything I'd walk I don't, I can't really think of much. You but, stand by all your statements. Um, I don't know. It's, it's tough because I've said so many things, but mm -hmm. there's nothing that really comes to the top of my head, you know. Mm -hmm. um, hmm. I would say one of the most misconstrued things is people think I hate women. That's like something I get 24-7. Okay. Okay. But I, I think, you know, we can't really have progress if we're not honest. So I, I just, I'm all about honesty. Got it. So why do you think people think you hate women? Oh, because I say things like women are dumber than men. Yeah. <laughs> and you stand by that. Oh yeah. yeah. So okay. So women. <laughs> I just are look at I just look at the top women and the top men. It's like Kim Kardashian or Elon Musk. Right. <laughs> like, what conclusion am I supposed to come to when literally all the female billionaires um, like tend to be billionaires through sex work or the, through divorce? Exactly. Yeah. Mackenzie the Bezos, mm -hmm. uh, Steve Jobs' wife. The list yeah. goes on and on and on. Yeah. So, you know, some people take that offensively. Um, and I mean it. So, yeah, you so, can be mad. So nothing, you're not walking anything back. Stand not by all, your statements. That's how you know you're a true believer. Yeah, you're like, I, ah, I wish I could have a mulligan and take that thing back. But the, mis the I'm biggest. I'm sure there is something. I talk so much. I just can't think of it now. No you doubt. You know what I mean? But the biggest <laughs> misconception is that you hate women. Yeah. But you're saying that you don't. But how do you feel about women? I just think the last hundred years, you know, we've been given more freedom than ever and we've made terrible choices as a group. You know, I just think when you look at the numbers, you can't really dispute that, right? So a hundred years ago, 85% of women are virgins. Now we have more OnlyFans models than teachers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, the, <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like what, what conclusion am I supposed to come to when I look at these numbers? Got it. What else do you think are women getting terribly wrong in modern society? Um... I would just say women typically want a lot of freedom without the responsibility that comes with it. I don't have any problem with, you know, women having freedom, but you should also have the responsibility that comes with it. That's why women shouldn't vote, because they don't want to do the infrastructure jobs. They don't want to be net taxpayers, and they want to take money from men through divorce and alimony. And I think if you're going to do that, most women do. I think you should not be able to vote. Yes. Got it. Which is also something we're going to discuss today. Yeah. So, Nat. Yes. Uh, newsflash, you're a woman. Yes, I okay? am. Okay. <laughs> so, um, we're going to get into a lot of stuff today. Mm -hmm. When Pearl says things like, look, you're just, you're dumber than me, Nat. I mean, that's not a crazy controversial topic, to be honest with you. She also says someone like you shouldn't vote. How do you process that smarter. as a woman? I think she's smarter than some guys, though. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Here's yeah. my thing is that I'm not going to compare a man to a woman. You know, they're meant to be doing different things. So for you to say, oh, a man is stronger than a woman or a man is smarter than a woman, and you know, as essentially a man's resources and the things they have to do, it does give them the skills to be smarter. They're supposed mm -hmm. to be smarter. They're, mm -hmm. they're leading. They're guiding. So, mm -hmm. like, things like that, I'm also considering, like, things, certain things don't trigger me because I may not feel like I'm in that boat of, like, I'm arguing with a man, like, if they're smarter with me. Mm -hmm. Now, men are more resourceful, for sure. There's, there's, there's a, you ever there's seen a point you of ever truth, seen? Which, is, which is supposed to be, like, biologically. But mm -hmm. at the end of the day, a woman's role is completely different than a man. So, for me, it's like... You know, that's kind of just. Have you ever your... seen that? Have you ever seen that um, episode of Survivor where they put like a bunch of women For sure, on an island yeah. and a bunch of men on an island? How does it go? And the men are like, they yeah. have like a whole system running. Yeah, within they're a like, day. yeah, there's like a fire the, going. Like yeah, they're and the, resourceful. And the, and the women basically had to be rescued. Yeah, but the, here's the thing, though. Yeah. I mean, as it should. 
Like, I wouldn't, I mean, what is a woman supposed to do? Like, go and, and be good at those things and not, not have that nurture side as well. So mm -hmm. there's strengths and there's well, weaknesses. women aren't even more nurturing. Yeah, I disagree with that. Well, I disagree completely. I think if you want to look at nurturing, who is the most likely one to kill infants and the elderly? Women. So I actually think we have all this propaganda saying like women are so nurturing and all this stuff. Well, I when, think when naturally you say, on, let me women. say that for a second. When you, know, you say you the know, infants, infants and the elder, elderly, you're saying abortion? No, both. So even how are like, they killing so, the elderly? So they're more likely to kill the elderly. In what regard? Like they are more likely to kill an elderly person. Like than euthanasia? A male. No, like like violent like in nursing homes, that sort of thing. Like you'll see ah. the you'll see the cases pop up in the news where these, sure. these, girl, these female nurses. But, even, but that's even, even more of a mental you, health. That's where a woman's mentality maybe is not as strong enough as a man. So again, it kind of goes back to what you're comparing. You're comparing apples. No, to I actually, apples. I think no, I think women are more violent than men. Um, and if you look at one-sided abuse, seventy percent of the time it's um, women hitting the men and not men hitting the women. So I actually would argue that women are more violent than men. They just can't be. And I also think and, that... And so infant side, so a woman killing or someone killing a baby within the first 24 hours of life is very rare for a male to do that. Like, it's like almost unheard of. So then, but how many males are in that division to be comparing how many women? What do you mean? How are they measuring that? Like, the amount of women in that mm -hmm. field, right? Mm -hmm. There's a lot more women in that field than men. Are you talking about nursing? Well, I, I mean, yeah. parenting, there's usually a dad and a mom. And right, the but mom I'm talking about, still... like, nursing, for example, right? Yeah. You see more women nurses there. So those numbers right, but, make sense. No, but it's not new. So, and this is, this is the thing. Like, a lot of times the stuff you see today you think is new. It's not new. In the 1800s, women were also more likely to kill infants, even in, before abortion, before nursing, before all this stuff. Interesting. Malik, run a poll. Who's more nurturing, <laughs> men or women? Listen, we're going to have a wild array of conversations. <laughs> we're going to talk about... My yeah. Hold on now. We're going to talk about even, uh, an array of topics. I've never heard in my life that, that men are more nurturing than women. So what made you come to that Well, I conclusion? just, I, the conclusion I came to was, <coughs> you know, when I think of nurturing, I think of how do you interact with the innocent? And I, I guess more of my point is that women are more violent than men, I would argue, because I think women are more likely to kill the innocent, where men are not. I think men just tend to be better people in general. Yes. So men are better people. <laughs> yeah, and I'll tell you why. I think there's reasons for that. Because typically, if one guy is being too bad of a person, another guy will come and check him. Where women don't necessarily have that. Even if you look at prison sentences, you see these women that constantly get bailed out of bad decisions. So like Casey Anthony got let out of jail. Right? She's, in, she's remarried now. And you'll see cases like that all the time. Women don't get the same sentences that men get when it comes to prison sentences as well. Mm -hmm. I just, I, I don't see women having the same consequences in society. And I just, I think women have a harder time regulating emotions. So I, that's why I think they're more violent personally. Well, it also comes down to the amount of freedom that has been given too, because women have gotten, numbers have gotten to this point as well, based on the, the eligibility that women can do certain things now. So now that they have more freedom to do the things, maybe they don't know how to handle certain emotions, behaviors. Maybe they shouldn't no, be part I, again, of things No, but again, I said this well. isn't this isn't new. That's that was what I said before. So even before they had the freedom of the right to vote, women were still more likely to kill infants in the 1800s, 1700s, 1600s. This is not new. So can it be attributed and to the fact that, um, that you no know, men are true. more hierarchical, mm -hmm. women are more egalitarian? So if you look at a spectrum of things. Men, by a wide margin, are going to be smarter, stronger, mm -hmm. wealthier, mm -hmm. more, uh, in, in your regard, more uh, nurturing, more protective, where women sort of associate in the middle of the spectrum, more egalitarian. Oh, yeah. And then all the way to the left, more men are psychopaths, murderers, absolute idiots, more men are homeless. Uh, and just don't win in life. Well, so I it's think, more like men are on the opposite sides of the spectrum, well, whereas men, women sort so of we would have to go, stay in the we middle. We would have to go through each and every one of those. So if you wanted to go through homeless, I would argue that more women would be homeless if they actually face consequences for their decisions. Mm -hmm. um, if you want to go based on what was the other things you said, homeless. Um, Barbaric, murderers, vicious, so even manslaughter, murderers, that's like homicide. Saying, that's like, like women cannot murder in the same way men can murder, I, I would argue. One, I don't think they're smart enough to pull it off. <laughs> I don't think you're going to get a women Ted Bundy <laughs> the same way you're not going to get there, a woman. There's some out there, but not as many as men. <laughs> not like, as many. That's, that's my point. I think, I think men are more likely to get away with it for longer. Um, but the second thing I would say is that 
Um, I, I would argue that... Wait, sorry. What was what was the second one? All the vicious crimes. Oh, the vicious crimes. Again, you have to look at abuse and who murders the innocent. Women cannot be violent in the same way men can be violent. They can't. But when they can be violent, they are more likely to kill the innocent. So when women have the opportunity to be violent towards the infants and the elderly, they are more likely to kill. Got it. And is that, kind of to Nat's question, is that just sort of a circumstantial meaning they're around more infants? They're the ones dealing with actual babies, daycares, nurseries, or even women are way more inclined to go into nursing and healthcare. So they're just kind of in that situation. So by the law of large numbers, so they're going to be more likely. <laughs> so you, you That's like that saying men are more likely to kill other people at war. Yeah, because 95% of the military you know what's is so men. interesting. It's like whenever there's a bad stat about women, we always have this like gut reaction to like give a reason or an excuse. Mm -hmm. But no, but this I think is the best stat in general. This is even 1807. These are completely different time periods. Women were always more likely to kill the infants and the elderly. God. So look, I'm not, I'm here to have an actual yeah. conversation. I've never, you know, you said that you think that men are more nurturing than women. I that's the first time I've ever heard that. Right. Mm -hmm. I think that men uh, will do more right out of unconditional love for a woman whereas a lot of women will have conditions mm -hmm. in order to give love mm -hmm. right like a man must be this 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 and this whereas a guy will just be like yeah she's hot she's cool and she's mm -hmm. a uh, loyal girl I'll, I'll give her the world whereas a woman wants six foot six pack six figures this that mm -hmm. funny crazy this all that stuff mm -hmm. so there, there's a longer checklist of what a man uh or that a woman is looking for versus what a man is looking for yeah, but that that we were talking about like nurturing kids. I thought no, yeah, but okay. also, but no, you just said nurturing. Yeah, you, yeah. You said nurturing kids. I'm saying in general, mm -hmm. women would be considered more nurturing, but also yeah. have. I just I just think like we have to like whenever women have a, like something that describes women that makes them so special and awesome, it's always something that can't be measured. And whenever you measure it, the stats mm -hmm. never line up. Okay, and so, so that's that's an example I'm giving where it's like if we were more nurturing wouldn't we be less likely to kill our children? So to, just to kind of put a ribbon on this, yeah. um, you know, I, I said, what's the biggest misconception about you? Yeah. You said, well, people think I hate women. Yeah. But it doesn't seem like you s speak fondly of women. So what would you describe your relationship with women if you can sum it up? <laughs> what's my relationship like with women? No, just like the, the concept of women. I, I like women. I like guys, you know. Okay. I mean, it's not. But no, there's no doubt that I you. I just don't. I just don't think like. I think there's a lot of propaganda that says mm -hmm. women are these special, Do amazing. Do you find purpose in a woman? Do you find purpose in a woman? Let her answer the question. Like, I just think that there's all of this propaganda that always says women are so special and amazing and mm -hmm. awesome, and I just think women are people the same way men are people. Yeah. They're special women. They're special men, you know. But I, I just think as a group, you know, they're just normal people. Got it. Okay. But I do think they're more violent than men. I'll die on that hill, actually. Right. Every time I've been attacked, like physically, like threatened, always a woman. Always. I hope so. <laughs> it's not a man. <laughs> I yeah. hope not. Okay. So um, you don't hate women. You just think they're not special. Is that fair to say? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Fair enough. I think um, most people aren't special. But the difference is men know that. Women, not as much. Yeah, I don't see men running around being like, I'm a king, I'm the man, no, no matter what you no, say. No, no. It's sure. like, buddy, you're broke, you're homeless, you live with your mom, yeah, uh, I, you have three well, socks even, to your name. I came uh, to this whereas women, they're all queens no matter what their situation is. Well, and I came to this I do conclusion. Feel you on that. I came to this conclusion was I, I literally couldn't think of one thing that women are better at. I couldn't. Because every time I had to measure it and put a number to it. I have one thing. Okay, please. It's going to be super controversial. Okay. Uh, giving <laughs> birth. <laughs> I hope so. Okay, that's, the, that's kind of the okay, one me thing. Out, Women me do out, create hear life. Me out, hear I do me love out. my mom and my hear grandma. Me if men could figure out a way to do it, I would argue they'd figure out a way to do well, it. Well, let's hope they don't. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. If you like that one, click right here to watch the full Sauce cast, And don't forget to subscribe to the channel.